Good evening. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, how are you? Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening everybody. Oh. Okay, we are almost ready to start now. As you can see, I'm recording uh, the class. I don't know if you remember yesterday, I, I have uh, a problem. Suddenly my screen uh, stopped. And then we uh, continue working, but at the end of the of the session, when I was trying to to look for the video, I realized that I got only just the first part, you know. What the reason today I'm checking everything in order to be sure that we are doing the right things, but suddenly uh, maybe has to do with connection or something like that, the platform or some, or some nation, I don't know.
Okay. Let me get my lesson order to check up the names. We are going to. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you. Okay, uh, I got it here. Ana Beatriz. Ana Beatriz, it's not here. Ana Lilian. Ana present, Lilian. present. Okay, Ana Lilian. Eh, Escobar. Present. Selina Guadalupe. Present. Diana Stephanie. Present. Okay. Eric Orlando. Jose Jonathan. Jonathan. Juan Carlos Rivas. Juan Carlos Rivas. Here, eh, Laura, Maria Concepción, present, Maria Elena, now here. Mario Ernesto. Presentation. Mayra. Mayra Veraliz. Zaira Marlene. Presentation. Okay. Misael. Misael, Wendy Maribel, present teacher, okay, Jenny Suleima, Jenny, Yesenia Lisset.
Okay, um, let us try to do something different now. Can you see it? Can you see the white one? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Well, let, let me write down something here and then I'm going to get bigger. My let me see. Yeah. Well, I guess at the moment that you are going to type. Okay, uh, what we are going to do is this. I need that you try, let me, let me, let me see in the order that I have here. Anna Lillian. Are you there, Anna Lillian? Anna Lillian. Yes, teacher. Okay, try to clip uh, next to the letter eight. And you are going to continue with uh, We are going to create uh, an, a story. But I'm going to assign the, the, the moment that you are going to write down something. But let, let me see if you can do it. Yeah, first of all, you need to click, click inside. Lo primero que tiene que hacer es da, dar click dentro a la parte de la letra A para para poder escribir, hágalo para ver si funciona. Bueno, no sé qué escribir. Ya, yeah, ya, yeah, but, but try to try to click on it. Okay. Ahí. Okay, what you are going to do is that you are going to continue with your previous ideas. Right, right there say once upon a time there was a and you are going to continue in order that we are going to create the, the story. I don't know if you got my idea. No, I don't understand my idea. Okay, I'm going to explain it in Spanish. Ok, lo que vamos a hacer es tratar de usar esta herramienta y que ustedes puedan escribir y darle continuidad al inicio de una historia que yo tengo acá. Para ello lo que tienen que hacer es darle clic dentro a la parte de la última palabra y escribir su oración que tenga continuidad con lo previo. Si no lo podemos hacer así como pensaba hacerlo en orden, de la lista, le voy a pedir a alguien más que, 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 que tenga la voluntad de hacerlo. Porque queremos ver, eh, les he habilitado que puedan editar. Who wants to do it? Mi teacher. Ok, try to do it. Try to write yeah. Per, per, solo, perdón, ¿dónde hay que darle clip? Inside the, the, the box.
No sé si ve dónde está el cursor. No. You don't see it? No. Okay, but, but try to write down. Uh, oh, let me let me see how can we do. If we can do it in, inside the, the the box that I have here, si no lo pueden hacer dentro del cuadro que tengo acá, eh, traten de clicar la uh, en la letter T, and you are going to get a box, and you can write down your sentence. But try to do it now, please. Okay, okay, somebody write. No, 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 hold on. What you need to do is continue. Uh, you need, lo que necesito es que continúen la idea que ya está. Ya esa parte ya está. Once upon a time, there was, usted va a buscar qué es lo que, sobre qué se va a basar la historia. Okay, cada quien, every one of you, uh, I need that you think, but, but we need to see the, the first line in order to get an idea. No sé si me comprenden qué es lo que pretendemos hacer. Usted ha iniciado una historia. Yes, and somebody y hay else. Que continuarla. Yes. But I need that somebody write down the next sentences. Oops. Pero teacher me borra. Me borra todo cuando quiero borrar algo. No. ¿Cómo lo regreso? Porque ya no lo veo. Ok, vea, yo presiono en la T, doy clic, me aparece, ya lo tengo acá. De ahí lo que hago es hacerlo más grande. Ahí está. Ahí aporté algo yo, teacher. Ok, ok, ok. Once upon a time, there was an English student. Ok, somebody can continue. But try to do it in the same line here. I can see the line. Okay, continue, continue. In a country where they live a beautiful girl named Diana. Okay, somebody else, somebody else. Try to do it, try to do it. Somebody help, please. I couldn't write it, I don't know where. Why not? It can, if you are in, in the phone, you can write. I was, uh, I connected from a website. 
on the on the crown and I didn't see where I can write. I don't, I don't know, uh, but I, I would like to be sure if all of you can see my, my whiteboard right now. Me too, teacher, I can't write. Really? No. I see the whiteboard, but it's, it's blank. I don't know what is happening here then if you don't, if you can do it. I've been using with other groups, but, but well, I don't know what is happening here. Okay, if we can do it uh, in this way, uh, I'm going to to close my whiteboard and we are going to do it in a different way. Okay, I don't know why you, you, you are not able to, to see it. Qué terrible, no podía hablar ni ver ni nada. Qué feo esa pantalla. Really? <laughs> Sí, horrible. Yo me he salido veces. Pensé que no, que no estamos conectados. Okay. Okay, I'm going to start the, the story and I'm going to say a name. In this case, uh, I don't know who wrote. Uh, there was an English teacher. I don't know if it was uh, Escobar or somebody else, I don't, I'm not pretty sure. Who is it? Quien fue el que escribió esa parte, Escobar? Me, me teacher. Okay, I'm going to say it and you are going to continue and you are going to name to someone else. In my case, I said, uh, once upon a time, there was, Escobar, continue. And a student in uh, English a student. Okay. Um, Diana? Continue, Diana. Uh, there was a, a English student, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, who won learn English? Oh, who want to learn more about uh, business English, business vocabulary? Okay, uh, name someone else. Eric. And he was was taking a course of English corporative. Sir, the vote to somebody else, please. Uh, Wendy. I don't know. Come on, you can do it. Me sacó y no sé qué están haciendo. Okay, what what about you, um, Mario Ernesto? The course the was taking uh, uh, every day from Monday from Monday to Friday. I start in 
8 p.m. and finish at 10 p.m. Name somebody else, please. I want you to have better opportunities and I need that be learning English, I will achieve it. Okay, next, how we have? No me funciona el next. Veo que tengo que estar siempre diciendo nombres. And he decided to have a part-time job. Okay, he decided to have a part-time job. Laura, Laura. Yeah. The student currently he is dedicated to write not in the city newspaper. Mm. Está hablando del estudiante que escribía, es que aprendió inglés. Oh, era un buen estudiante eh, de inglés o no? Eh, o es continuo. Eh, o es está, continuo. Ajá. Estamos creando una historia con todos los aportes. Ah, ok. El inicio comenzó diciendo que era un, un buen ah, estudiante no, 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 no. de inglés. No, 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 o, no o ya no. no. Don't tell me the beginning. You need to oh. continue the next idea. Ah, de, o sea, siempre con ons o pon a time. No. Eh, no. Me perdí, no. Ticha. <ríe> Me perdí con lo que dijeron los compañeros. Uno dijo que era de negocio de inglés. Eh, ok, el ok, dijo, ok. Yo okay. no sé qué. Hold on, hold on. <ríe> ok. Yeah, this exercise is pretty good in order that, that all of you need to pay attention about what we are doing. And, and that way you are connected with the, with the language, you know? But, but suddenly, uh, if you are not paying attention or I don't know what else, uh, you can uh, stop the story, you know? Who, who was the previous, the previous of you, Lilian? Who did the last part before Laura? Lo que dije yo, yes, yes, repeat it again. Uh, try, try to remember, try to remember in a hurry, please. We need to have better opportunities and I I need I, I need that be learning English. I will I've tried it. Okay, somebody wants to continue? I need that all of you participate, giving your ideas. Maria Concepcion is missing, Yesenia. Um, no, me, no me wants to travel to USA. Okay. Ahí está Selena y ella está de listener y está participando, vea. Okay. Somebody else. But it was very difficult for him to memorize the words. Ah, okay. How is the right uh, way to say it? To memorize or to learn by, by heart? We can use it too, okay? Okay, continue. Somebody else, somebody else? In the end, at least somebody.
Let us finish. Somebody wants to finish. What happened at the end? Tell me. And after all the problems to learn a new language, he continued doing his best and he gets a good job. Okay. In USA. Okay. okay, thank you, Selena. Okay, I, I need that you start thinking in, in a in a fast way because in that way you are going to be able to, to, to communicate with anybody. I know that sometimes it's really difficult to do it, but you need to try to do it. Okay. Here we go. Okay, we are going to talk about transitional results. And I was thinking that, that you were able to use one of those words that we are going to study today. As you can see in the picture, we can, we can see we have a different word, like a finally this pie, for example, although you know, the words currently seen, furthermore, additionally, as well as, and so on. But let us see what, it, uh, what is the concept of transitions. The first question is, what are transition words? Somebody wants to read it? Me, teacher. OK. Transition, tra what are transition words? Transition are words help the reader move smoothly from one idea to another. A transition acts like a rousing or signal flag to let readers know where they are and to tell readers what to expect coming up next in a paragraph or essay. Essay. Okay, thank you. I need that all of you, if you are willing to do it, that you practice reading. Okay, somebody else wants to do it?
Okay, I'm going to read transitional words that help the reader move smoothly, smoothly from one idea to another. Okay, and we are going to stop there. That is the, 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 the concept of transition. Are words that help the reader move smoothly from one idea to another. A transition acts like a road sign or signal flat to let reader know where they are and to tell reader what to expect coming up next in a paragraph or essay. Okay. In other words, who wants to tell me in your own words the concept? Hello, 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 are you there? Hello, are you reading or not? Okay, I'm going to continue. All transitions are not created equal. You must use the transition in the appropriate places. Okay, let, let us see. Who wants to read? Me, teacher. Okay. Trans transition that show main points. First, second, third, finally, next, last, another thing more significantly. Ah, okay. This translation uh, show main point and order. Uh, if you are going to explain a process, you are going to use these words. Imagine that I, um, I ask you to explain me a recipe, you are going to, to use these words. Okay, somebody wants to give me an example using at least three or four transition word that we have in the screen now, please. Me teacher. Okay. Um in my day, first, uh, get up. Uh, second, I take a shower. Uh, here, uh, wearing uh, my clothes. Huh? Oh, of, of my clothes. Um, finally, uh, take my breakfast. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Good. Good job. Good job. Somebody else. Somebody else. We can relate it with the, the previous topic that we have started. What about if I ask you to use this word uh, in order to select a CPL? How can you use it? Okay, but let's continue if you don't want to, to relate the topic, okay? Try to do it in a 
using different process. Okay, come on, I need some, uh, a volunteer who wants to, to do it. Okay, I'm going, I'm going to give you a hand. What about if you want to record a video? What, tell me the step using these words. Me teacher, if I will record a video, first I will write a script, second I will search the person who will act, and third I will uh, put this person to acting, and finally I will edit that video. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let, let, let me move forward because we have more than, okay, transition the show example. At the moment that you are explaining something, you can say, for example, but also if you are not in a basic level, you can use the word for instance, you know, for instance. Also, in addition, to add another example, okay, somebody uh, want to give uh, to give me some example using these words. Hello. I don't see any any, any hand up, you know. Who wants to do it? Remember, if you put in practice the words, you are going to keep it in mind. But if you just listen or read, it is going to be difficult for you. You need to practice. Okay, I'm going to continue if you don't want to, to participate. Also, we have transition the show conclusion. Like truly, all in all, in conclusion, as you can see. But the scene is how you are going to use it. Because we, we have the list of words, but what I want is that you use it in a sentence. We can, uh, we can find also transition that show contrast by although, besides, conversely, however, nevertheless, on the contrary, 
if you learn how to use all these words, you are going to be able to have a excellent communication. Transition they show cause and effects. And you can say as a result, consequently, therefore, somebody wants to give me an example using these words. For example, I have a lot of ideas on my mind. As, as a result, I create my own business. Okay. Okay, thank you. Somebody else? I didn't make any homework on this uh, on this course consequently i failed okay what about the last one i call all clients consequently i sell i sell a, a a more tickets. More tickets. <laughs> a ticket. Okay, let me see. Okay, let me stop here because what I want is that you share your ideas. But in this case, let, let us see the material. Okay, before uh, we see the material, let us see this transition. We have different kinds of, trans of transition. All depend on the writing purpose, you know? And that way you are going to use the transition. For example, to add an idea, you are going to use the words also in addition, furthermore, moreover, besides. What about to show time or sequence? Jesenia Lisset. Hello, teacher. I don't understand nothing. No, what you are going to what you are going to do is just read the words that are at the same level of the one that I'm reading. For example, if I say to show time or sequence, you are going to read this one. Teacher, se me corta su audio. No le escucho bien. Oh, okay. What about the rest? Can you hear me very well or not? Yes, teacher. Oh, okay. To add an idea also, in addition. Hold on, okay, continue, continue. Also, in addition, for, for, for sir, more, more, oh, whatever, beside, besides. Okay. If you want to add an idea to a paragraph, you are going to use one of those words. What about the next one? To show time or sequence. Somebody else, I need that somebody else read. Meanwhile, fresh, second, then, next, finally. 
Okay, meanwhile, first, second, then, next, finally. And that way you are going to show the sequence of something. Okay, to show result. Therefore, continue. Yeah, 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 continue. Thank you. Therefore, that consequently as a result. Okay. Today, according to the material, we need to study only this one. But I was thinking that maybe uh, you are not going to have the, the opportunity to, to study all this, this word for that reason I, I, I have it here in order that you can get uh, a general idea about this. But let us read it and then we are going to focus our attention in this, this words. Okay, to show unexpected result. Somebody else. I don't know, maybe I'm having problem with my microphone. I'm sorry to stop here. As you can see, I got uh, 14 people here. That means that as soon as I ask you to participate, maybe not only one is going to write his or her hand. But what I need is that you uh, get involved in the class. Okay, who wants to read it? To show an expected result, However, nevertheless, still thought uh, usually at end of sentence, not less. To show contrasting situation, however, on the other hand, in contrast, by contrast, to show similarity, similarly, likewise, in a similar way, to emphasize something, in fact, of course, indeed, certainly, to be sure, to provide an example, for example, for instance, to explain that is, in other words, to add a new topic, by the way, incidentally, to return to a topic, anyway, at any rate, to argue, on the contrary, rather, to summarize or generalize, in general, overall, in short, in conclusion, in summary, all in all. Okay, uh, try to Make an screenshot now, and you are going to choose one of these situations, and you are going to create one sentence and tell me. Okay, you have it? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay. I'm going to check up the attendance and then we are going to start. I'm going to ask you one by one in order that you give me an example.
This is really, really important that you learn in order to have an efficiency communication. Okay, Ana Beatriz. Ana Beatriz. Ana Lilian. Present. Escobar. Present. Eh, Selina. Present. Diana. Present, teacher. Okay. Eric. Present. Okay, Jose Jonathan. I don't see Jonathan here. Eh, Juan Carlos Rivas. Present. Okay. Laura. Present teacher. María Concepción. Present. María Elena. Hi, teacher. Hello. Eh, Mario Ernesto. Presentation. Okay. Mayra Veralice. Not here. Zaira Marlene. Present teacher. Okay. Misael. Present teacher. Wendy. Present teacher. Jenny Suleima. Jenny Sulaima. Yesenia Lisset. Present teacher. Okay, it's here. Thank you. Okay, let us start with the example. You have a, a lot of options in order to, and different choices that you can use. Okay, let me start with Okay, I'm going to start with the the ones that have the camera off. Okay, let me do it. Uh, Mario Ernesto. Yes, Misha. Your example, sir. I don't have an example because I was trying to reconnect it in three times. So I, I don't know. I, I see the, the page, but the, the example, but I don't know what exactly is the example. Okay. Okay, let me show you again and I'm going to tell you. We have here different transition. We have um, we have to add an idea to show time or sequence. You are free to choose whatever you want. Okay. Okay. I like cars. For example, a uh, boogie car. Okay. Juan Carlos? Tell me, teacher. Y no, no, me he perdido, solo me, quedo, me acabo de incorporar. Okay, okay. Maria Elena. Hi, teacher. 
Um, I remember um, the part of a song that mentioned the price. In other words, I can sing you. <laughs> Uh -huh. Is the, <laughs> say, fly me to the moon and let me play among the stars. Let me see what spring is like on Jupiter and Mars. In other words, <laughs> hold my hands. In other words, I don't know. <laughs> Hasta ahí me acuerdo. <laughs> okay, okay, nice. <laughs> Ah, uh, Wendy. Ah, okay, okay. I like that. I like that. I want to see your hands up. Wendy, Wendy. No, se lo está aplaudiendo a la otra. Oh, my goodness. I was thinking that you are eager to participate. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I'm going to continue with the order that I got. Yesenia said. Yesenia. No. Hi, teacher. Oh, okay. Ay, no sé. <laughs> ah, okay. Okay. Let me continue with Diana, Stefan. Uh, okay, I use, for example, um, if you want to invest, uh, you should know about that topic, for example, you should know how uh, the basis of, of some big companies, and uh, you can learn about that. Okay. Maria Concepcion. Maria Concepcion. Teacher, yo tengo problemas con el internet y le estoy escuchando súper cortada la clase. Oh, ok. Ana Lilian. Maria, teacher. Come on, I need that you hurry up because we need to continue with something else. Okay, Wendy. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> no idea. Okay, Escobar. No. Uh, okay, my in my phrase is the summary in general or general. Y El Salvador is the is the visit for the other people for the mountain the beach or the other place. In conclusion, in the El Salvador is the better, best, is the good option for the other peoples. Oh, okay. Okay. El Salvador is one of the best options. Okay. Eric. Let me see. Um, 
Mm -hmm. I like the ocean. Uh, in addition, I like seafood. <laughs> okay, okay. Misael. Um, I, I have it here. It says, I was watching the TV. Meanwhile, my pet was begging for food. So first I went to the kitchen. Second, I look for its food, and finally, I fed my pet. My pet. Okay, okay, Laura. Laura, Laura. Uh, it is a good idea. Idea by a big house. However, I didn't think we have the money to fund fund it. Fund it. <laughs> or fund it. However, however, uh, I don't think we have the money to fund it, to fund it. To find it, to find Fa it. Find it, o sea, fondos, financiamiento. Ah, you, you, <laughs> you are talking about money, right? Okay, yeah. Ah, okay, I got it, I got it. Maria Elena. Use. I have white deposited. Ah, Maria Elena, okay, okay. Uh, Wendy? Uh, I use in conclusion or other, other word. Yeah, you have a lot of words there. Ah, okay. Um, um, for example, Psychology is good for resolve your problem, um, but it's better uh, pray or oh God. In conclusion, God is solution of your problem. Okay, you are talking about psychologists, right? Psychology. Yeah, okay. psychology. Okay, uh, Saira. Side up. Yes, teacher. He used the therefore. I have an um, idea. Okay, tell us. Today I sent the day, therefore they are already informed. Informed, okay. Let me share with you the next slides it's because yeah, on this level, you are able to use just, um, if I say, okay, um, for example, I say, Laura, uh, use the word, by the way, and you are going to start doing that, that sentence. So please try to, if you don't have it, make a screenshot and try to look it up, all this word that you don't know in a dictionary. Okay, how to use transition or result? In this case, we are going to start therefore, consistently, as a result, does, for the reason, according to the material, okay? Also, we, I, I got some example here. Um, let me see, Saida, could you read it, please? Okay, teacher. <laughs> example. I have a long being interest in essence, <clears throat> pardon, and animals. Therefore, I have decided to study biology in college. The okay, other okay, okay, hold, on, hold, on, hold on. Only that. Yeah, only one. Okay. okay. Okay, I'm going to read again. I have long, I have long been interested in science and animals. Therefore, I had decided to study biology in college. Okay, continue with the next one, please. Okay. 
The athlete was caught using those. Secondly, he was kicked of the team. How do you say this word? Consequently. Ah, okay. <laughs> Consequently. Okay. Uh, as you see, it's really important that you participate. The athlete was caught using rock. Consequently, he was kicked off the team. Okay, the last one. Okay, I repeat. Cons consequently, he was kicker kick off. of the team. No, es que ya de una vez aquí, kick off. Ah, ok. Kick off, kick off the team. Kick off the team, ok. Someone called in a bomb treat as a result, the school was cancelled. Ah, ok. Someone called in a bomb threat as a result, the school was Council. Okay, could, could you tell me, uh, Laura, could you tell me in the first example uh, the transition word? Therefore. Ah, okay. Wendy, in the second one? The uh, sorry, the athlete, athlete. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just identify the the transition word. Ah, okay. Vamos a ver. Consequently. 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 Okay. Um, Misael, in the in the third one. The third one, right? Yes. Someone called. No, no, no. Yes, I identify the transition word. Mm, as a result. Ah, okay, okay, okay. And also, I need that you see that before this transition, there is a period. And after the transition, where we had a comma here. Pay attention to that, too. Okay, let us continue. Let me see who wants to read it. Um, let me see. Escobar. The government did not prepare for the hurricane. Truth, many people suffered. Okay, hold on there. The government did not prepare for the hurricane, thus many people suffered. Read again. The government did not prepare prepare for the hurricane. Hugh, Hugh, Just, Hugh, Hughes. No, no, no. You were start with hurricane. 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 With a, with a jota at the beginning, hurricane. Hurricane. Okay, continue. Just das, many people. Does das many das, people. Das many people okay. suffer. Okay, the next one. Continues. Yeah, 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 the second one. Rain is too expensive in Boston. For this reason, I have decided to move to Ohio. Okay. I have decided, decided. 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 Yeah, I have decided to move decided. to Ohio. Yeah. 
to move to Ohio. Rent is, rent is too expensive in Boston. For the reason, I have decided to move to Ohio. Okay, Maria Concepcion, the next one, please. Maria, are you there? No, okay. Diana? Yes, teacher. Could you read, please? It's a third one. Sure. Yeah, yeah, the third one. I used to waste all of my time watching TV shows that I didn't even like. For this reason, I decided to give away my TV so that I might start getting more work done. Okay. I decided, decided. 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 Idea, decided. yeah, decided. Okay. It is la, another example like when, when the verb uh, end in a T sound in a consonant, like uh, invite. It is invited. Only that happened with T sound and D sound. Okay. And right now we have uh, the part in the material say how to use transitional result. Look at the example in the box, then complete the exercise below. Transitions have connect ideas. In this case, this transition connect a result to the action that causes it. You need to be clear. You need to have really, really clear this concept. Transition helps connect ideas. In this case, this transition connects a result to the action that causes it. Okay, when the transition is positioned between two clauses, punctuation can be as follows. The label information was wrong. As a consequence, the packages were put in the incorrect bins. The product were not properly packaged. As a result, they were damaged. The vendors missed the delivery day. Consequently, the retailer asked for a reimbursement. We didn't know there were dangerous chemicals in the shipment. As a result, some workers had to go to the hospital. And the last one, there were not worker safety guidelines. Therefore, we train the staff in safety procedure. Okay, let me choose somebody else who wants to read it. Um, Juan Carlos, would you like to read the third example? This one. Uh, the label information was wrong. Okay, continue. As a consequence, the package were put in the incorrect bins. Okay, where? Yes. Where? Right here. Where? 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 Yeah. Where put it? Where putting the incorrect bins? Okay, thank you. Uh, Mario Ernesto. The products were not properly packaged. As a result, we are they, they were damaged. Okay, thank you. Uh, Selena, if you are able to do it, just do it. The next one. Yes. Maybe, maybe Stacy. Ah, oh, no, it's there. Okay, it's there. We didn't know, right? That one. Uh, let me see. No, dependence. 
the vendors miss the delivery date. Consequently, the retailer asks for a reimbursement. Okay, thank you. Let me see. Okay, Eric, the next one, please. We didn't know, right? Yes. Yes, we didn't know there were dangerous chemicals in the shipment. As a result, some workers had to go to the hospital. Okay, thank you. Yesenia, the last one, please. There were no workers safety guild lines. Therefore, we trained the staff in safety pursuit. Pro, no puedo, pros, pros. <laughs> okay, okay. Before I before that I tell you, I need that you repeat this guidelines. Guidelines. Gu guidelines. Okay. Guidelines. Try 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 to read it. Try to read again, including the pronunciation. There, okay, start again. There were there were no worker safety guidelines. Theref therefore, we trained the staff in safety procedures. Procedure, procedure. Procedure, procedures. Okay, that is the easy way that you can adopt. Okay. Now is your term, you are going to work in exercise number five. And read the warehouse issues below. Apply the corresponding punctuation and then compare your answer with a pattern. Okay, let us do it. Let us work on this. Okay, if you don't have it, you know what you have to do, right? because I need to stop chatting. Okay, if you want to take a look in your book, you can do it and let me see on page number 28. I'm going to share the material with you. Let me see, I got it here. No, it is, this is the same. What I want to show you is the book. Yeah, it's this one. Okay, you have it there.
As soon as you finish, just let me know, please. Did you finish? Yes, teacher. Okay, let us try to do it in the in the whiteboard. Let us see if now we can do it. Okay, try to try to write the file the file one using uh, punctuation. Can you see the whiteboard? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yeah, you can modify in order that 
Just stay in one line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Someone who wants to write the second one. We remove items from cartoons and packages. As a result, comma. Okay. Number two. Number two, please. Try to do it. I need that you learn how to use the wiper. The warehouse doesn't have enough ducks, therefore we have to put products in the in the ice Can you write it down in the in the whiteboard, Mario? I can't share. I didn't see the option. Maybe you are in in, in your cell. Let me download the app. Okay, somebody else? Somebody's trying to write down something or not? I need that you try to do it. Okay, we have number two. Okay, you you use semicolon, if that is right. Read it, please, read it. In this moment, you can practice writing and reading too. As soon as you, feel you finish writing, you can start reading the sentence. Okay, teacher. The vendor is shipping multiple items is a single box. Consequently, we have to watch time to open the, the box, count the item and remove them. Okay. In the last line, you read it like an uh, item, and the first one like item is item. Okay. Thank you, sir. Uh, number three, somebody else.
Number three, please. The warehouse doesn't have enough dog. Therefore, we have to put product in the islands. Can you write it in the ball? Escobar. Okay, we have number three there. Zaira. Yeah, yeah, Escobar. Uh, yep. Or somebody else uh, that would like to explain in Spanish how right on the on the on the board on the whiteboard, or somebody that that wants to explain a step by a step how to do it because I need that all of you are learn how to do it in english no no in spanish, I don't know. In, in, in spanish, in spanish. Yeah. So, solo te darle clip cerca de, de donde está la última frase dale doble clip y ahí ya puede escribir le aparece un recuadro y ahí puede escribir yo lo que estoy haciendo es pegarlos ok también se puede hacer ya se tiene en otra hoja solo se copia y solo se pega Yes, o le da, le da el clic y le da la opción de darle doble clic, ahí aparece el cursor y ya usted puede, puede escribir ahí. Ok, en español necesito que intenten hacer lo que aprendan. Esta es una pizarra interactiva donde todos como lo que quisimos hacer al inicio de hacer la historia, pero que todos iban a poner una oración. Yo no, lo que... yo, no... <risa> yo no puedo ni del teléfono ni de la compu. Hay que... Habrá que practicar mucho y le, le voy a dejar una, una pizarra. Yo... Yo no puedo ver lo que los demás escriben y he escrito, pero creo que no pueden ver lo que yo escribo. Ah, okay. Porque solo me aparece en blanco. Uh -huh. Ok, number four. Number four, please. Ah, it's there. Read it, read it, read it. Conveyor bell broke as, as a consequence, there is not enough stuff to put the arriving package away. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, now um, I need that uh, that you look on the page that I told you, or maybe you want to. I guess you already have a screenshot about this. You are going to work with somebody else, and what you are going to do. Is the next activity. Let me see. I'm going to show you here. Okay. 
in pairs, you are going to take your given advice on how to solve the issues about. And also you can use a uh, transition of the result. That means that we have uh, four different issues, you know? And you are going to discuss how you are going to resolve the problem for number one, number two, number three, and number four. Is that clear? Hello? What you are going to do is uh, that you are going to give an advice to every problem that we have here. And you are going to integrate transition of result. Se comprende la instrucción? Sí. Ah, okay. Esperemos que no se nos congele, porque por eso fue que se me congeló ayer. Por estar haciendo el break a room, you ¿no? Know? María Elena, ¿cuántos dispositivos tiene? Tú. Oh. But I can... Turn off one. Okay, I'm going to do, uh, let, let me let me do the talk. Okay, right try now. to try to resolve, uh, try to give an advice. And if you if you if you want, you can write it down in order that you can share it. Okay.
existe gracias a la ciencia. Tu seguridad nos preocupa. Okay, um, let me see. I'm going to choose one of you. If you hear your name, you are going to read the first issue. And the second one is going to give, give us an advice. Okay, Juan Carlos Rivas. Juan Carlos. Okay, um, let me switch. Diana Stephanie. Okay, teacher, for the first one. Uh, with Misael, would recommend to the uh, the they should have a, a inventory, a digital inventory, and also a SQ, SQ, you to identify the the packages. Okay. Do you want to add something, Misael? Yeah, actually, also, I suggest maybe uh, adding some tax for the box. Oh, okay. Okay, let me see somebody else. Ana Lilian? What about you? Are you there or not? Teacher. Hello, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Any and I uh, made the one sentence in, in the, if remove the item from the cartoon and package, be tidy. In other words, be careful. Ah, okay. Okay, thank you. Related with number one, uh, Mario Ernesto, number one. Hello. Are you there, Mario? No? Yes, yes, sir. I'm here. Okay. What about you? Uh, what, is, what is the solution that you advise for, for the number one? The number, the number one. With the yes. group things, uh, we can change the level to see uh, what, this, what the products we have. Okay, related with number two, um, Saira. Uh, the supplier has to pack a single product. Therefore, it will be easier for them to identify them. 
it's going to be easier to identify it. Okay. 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 okay thank you. Um, number three. Wendy, number three. Any idea? No, okay. In a moment. Okay. Let us see, maybe Selena is there. Oh, not like no, Selena, okay. Eric? Number four. Okay. Uh, the conveyor belt broke as a consequence. There is not enough stuff to put arriving packages away. And maybe they have to make a chain of workers so they, so they could uh, pass the packages faster. So one point to one. Okay, they need to move to one point to another. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much to all of you. Okay, let me check out the attendance now because it's time to do it. Okay, Ana Beatriz is now here. Uh, Ana Lillian. Ana Lillian, say hello, please. Say hello. Escobar. Present. Selena, Diana, present. Okay, Eric, present. Okay, uh, Jonathan, it's not here. Juan Carlos, present teacher. Laura, okay. Laura, Laura. Present, present. Eh, María Concepción. Present, chair. María Elena. Present. Okay. Uh, Mario Ernesto. Present, teacher. Mayra Veralice. Saida. Present teacher. Okay. Eh, Misael. Present teacher. Wendy. Present teacher. Jenny. Jenny. Now here, Jesenia. Present teacher. Okay, Wendy, you are number 18. It's your turn today to talk at the end of class. I don't know if you are able to do it. Me? Yes, you. Okay. Okay, before uh, you go, let me tell you this. I'm going to tell you in Spanish. Como se dieron cuenta el día de ayer, uh, se hizo un corte. Se me frizó la pantalla ahí por el minuto 45. Luego, uh, bueno, así como he estado hoy haciendo capturas de, de pantalla en el momento que, que, que estamos haciendo las uh, actividades, pero más que todo para que se vea que, que sí se está grabando y el tiempo que se lleva, ¿no? Entonces, el día de ayer, uh, a pesar de todo lo que se hizo, eh, solamente tenemos la mitad del vídeo. Yo sé que no es culpa de ustedes, 
eh, ni tampoco quizá mía, porque de repente, así como se le frisa la pantalla a cualquiera de ustedes, también se me puede frisar a mí. Lo que quiero decir con esto es que a ah, esa forma hizo la sugerencia que debemos de hacer como un review de algún tema que tengamos por ahí y será solamente una hora con 16 minutos, que es lo que nos, que me hizo falta en el, en el que no se, al final no se recuperó la grabación. Entonces, por eso hoy he estado buscando a uh, una manera de cómo grabar incluso, además de grabar en Zoom, estar grabando la pantalla, porque estamos viendo... Eh, bueno, si yo les compartiese los comentarios de mis compañeros que también estamos teniendo los mismos problemas. A algunos les está tocando subir dos partes, a otros no les deja, solo suben una. Entonces espero la comprensión eh, y veremos cómo eh, nos arreglamos. Y antes de, de que nos vayamos, invitarles a que busquemos la manera de cómo usar la pizarra interactiva. Solo es de darle doble clic. En, justamente después de donde está, si es que hay eh, algún inicio. Y de esa manera eh, ustedes pueden escribir. Necesito que aprendamos todos juntos y sin temor, sin miedo. La otra cosa es que eh, ya a estas alturas, si se les da, por ejemplo, solo una palabra, ustedes deben de ser capaces de crear una oración en forma rápida. Entonces, eso es algo que debemos de practicarlo para que de esa manera mejoren la fluidez. Ese es el objetivo. Y como he venido diciendo, eh, bueno, yo trato por todos los medios de que todos participen, pero a veces es como muy difícil porque, bueno, yo sé, el día ha sido muy ocupado y a veces estamos pensando en, tal vez en algo otras cosas. Pero les pido de favor que nos concentremos un poco para que podamos tomar el hilo de, de, de las actividades. Si, si, por ejemplo, hoy hubiésemos hecho en forma escrita la historia, al final hubiese sido bastante divertida posiblemente. Pero eh, lástima no se pudo hacer porque algunos no veían ni, eh, ni, 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 la, ni la pizarra. Entonces eso nos generó como algún inconveniente. Pero... Espero que poco a poco vayamos como mejorando en el tiempo que hace falta, porque ya falta poco. Así es que adelante y eh, con las actividades de la plataforma necesito que se pongan al día también para que no nos vaya a tomar por sorpresa ya los últimos días. Eh, generalmente, pues ya saben de que en mi caso, si terminamos un viernes a las 8 de la mañana, yo el cuadrado. Y yo estoy entregando a las 8 de la mañana todo el cuadro de notas. Entonces, por eso les pido y les suplico que hagan un espacio para ir a, al día con las actividades y no nos, uh, no nos demoremos. Ok, thank you very much. And I hope to see you tomorrow. I don't know if you are. Ok, go ahead. Good bye -bye. night. Thank you, teacher. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye. okay. Okay, Wendy. Okay, okay, teach. I'm afraid to 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 close the session, you know. Estoy con temor de cerrar la sesión el día de hoy por pasó ayer. Eh, hice todo el proceso, ah. hice todo el proceso igual como uh -huh. lo hago a la hora que le di cerrar uh -huh. sesión. ¿Sí? Solo solo eh, me apareció en los archivos el primer vídeo, no el segundo, después del corte de que se frisó la pantalla. Ah, Entonces, pues, después eh, de, de que se le frisó ya no le funcionó. No, ya no lo grabó, pero aparentemente aparecía que estaba grabando. 
eh, incluso yo iba a estar contabilizando los minutos y eh, uh -huh. Isabel se quedó al final de la clase para aclarar uh -huh. algunos temas y fuimos trabajando en base al tiempo que nos hacía falta y todavía estoy hablando con él pero resultó que cuando ya le di cerrar me dio la sorpresa que no comenzó a convertir no el había grabado no comenzó a convertir el vídeo sí, sí, pues... sí estaba porque hoy, eh, hoy he estado como haciendo unas capturas para que así al, ah, final, ah. al final se sepa de que te estaba grabando ah ya Sí, porque más creo que quizás es como un, una falla que está teniendo Zoom. Porque eso no me ha sucedido solamente a mí, sí. le ha pasado a más compañeros. Entonces, pero eh, uh -huh. la parte buena es que solamente no vamos a hacer una sesión así, sino que solamente va a ser el tiempo que nos hace falta, que es como una hora y, y diez Ay, minutos. Dios, una hora. Yeah. Sí. Entonces ahí aprovechamos uh -huh. de hacer algún repaso. Eh, es importante, sí. por ejemplo, muchas palabras, lo que vimos hoy, esas palabras son básicas para tener una buena comunicación. Entonces yo les invito a que sí. hagan un poco de tiempo y las que no se las saben, pues hay que aprendérselas, incorporarlas a, a oraciones y frases y de esa manera uh -huh. va a ser más fácil al momento de hacer una redacción de un párrafo una carta eso es como un mapa que ayuda a, al lector a que se vaya guiando y vaya comprendiendo uh -huh. lo que se ha escrito ya sí sí yo lo que estaba viendo de, 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 de todas las clases es que en realidad, si uno viene como, bueno, yo no vengo tan nula de inglés, pero lo básico, súper básico, ¿verdad? No, no, no sé mucho, porque es más tecnicismo el sí. que se ve en esto, ¿verdad? O yes. sea, es más técnico. Entonces, si uno, la, ver, la verdad es que si uno no trae base, no entiende nada. Yeah, and that is the problem, because uh, that, that is the reason why I've been telling you, create your own vocabulary. Por eso les he venido diciendo, cree en su vocabulario, cree en su vocabulario. De cada lección se va creando un vocabulario y así es la única forma que uno logra comprender bien de qué es lo que se ha hablado. Tal vez los temas es, va, digamos, entendemos los temas y todo eso, pero no es como, como le explicara. O sea, nosotros no, como no, es, no se trata de aprender inglés, o sea, no se trata de aprender en un inglés así normal, como de comunicación y todo eso, sino que es más un inglés técnico, porque por eso se llama inglés para el trabajo. Así es. Entonces, este, ya ustedes ya no pueden estarse como tomando el tiempo de explicarnos. O sea, de hecho, sí vemos un poco de gramática y gracias sí. a Dios que la vemos, porque si no, nos quedaríamos sí. más en la luna todavía. Pero eh, considero yo que esto, esto, estos cursos deberían de ser como, como le dijera, recibidos por alguien, pero que sepa inglés, el inglés normal, porque si no, uno, o sea, bendito Dios que hemos podido sobrevivir en todos estos módulos, pero realmente sí. es un tecnicismo el que se ve. Entonces, y lo, lo, que le, lo que le decía es, eh, usted tiene cierta razón, pero al mismo tiempo eh, lo que deben de hacer es como hacer un esfuerzo más, un doble, ¿no? Mayor, ¿verdad? Sí. sí. Tiene que ser un esfuerzo sí. doble para poder aprender los nuevos términos y usarlos sí. en el contexto que se están aplicando. Sí. Esto, eso, eso es lo que sucede. Por eso sí. es que es bien básico. Que, que, que se tenga un vocabulario bastante amplio para poder darlo con todos los nuevos términos. Y yo por eso eh, no ha habido clase, clase que no les diga, hagan su vocabulario, hagan su vocabulario. Porque si no crean su vocabulario, va a ser bien difícil el poder comprender sí. completamente de qué se trata. Fíjense que el tema que vimos sí. hoy fue, fue meramente gramatical, digamos. ¿Ya? Ese, ajá, ese sí estuvo más 
porque como así lo más familiarizado uno. Sí, porque, pero así lo sugiere la guía. Sí. Entonces la guía, la guía lo va relacionando con el tema que vamos mirando. Pero sin embargo, eh, si se ha dado cuenta de unos días para acá y he venido eh, incorporando algunas lecturas, algunos trabalenguas, eh, algunas sí. cosas para poder ir variando un poco eh, sí. y que les vaya dando como más oxígeno y más palabras, ¿no? Uh -huh. Ahora yo entiendo sí. cuando Porque yo... que nos cuesta expresarnos sí. todavía. Sí, entonces, mm. y lo que requiere el nivel es que, por ejemplo, lo que les estaba diciendo, que les doy una palabra y ustedes sean capaces de crearme la oración así en una. Sí. Ah, porque ya es eh, un nivel intermedio, entonces significa que ah, yo no debería ya estar hablando así en español, pero lo hago para que las cosas... Eh, queden bastante claras y sí. haya suficiente eh, confianza para que pueda eh, en cierto momento si tiene alguna duda porque alguien dice no como no le entendí en inglés mejor al final ni le pregunto en español porque no me va a decir pero claro yo les, les, les trato de ayudar hasta donde puedo no sí así es entonces, por eso es que lección que viene, esa debe ya estar eh, escudriñada. Palabras ya buscadas para saber cuando dice, ah, están hablando de tal cosa, esta palabra significa esto. Así. Sí. Pero claro, yo entiendo que no, no, no tenemos todo el tiempo porque los trabajos nos absorben. Y hay cosas, y hay cosas que se logran entender o, se, o al menos yo lo he logrado entender por, por las carreras que llevamos. Ajá. Por lo menos con Jenny estábamos comentando, ella lleva mercadeo, entonces me sí. dice yo casi que bien familiarizado con eso, le digo yo, yo algunas cosas porque yo o saqué administración, entonces este, igual desde bachillerato casi el, en el, el comercio, ahí se ven cosas de mercadeo, entonces es como que un poco se le hace a uno algo familiar los términos, yes. más por esa razón. Sí. Uh -huh. Sí, pero la sí. verdad es que sí se ha, se ha aprendido bastante, o sea, bastantes términos, bastantes cosas. Mire, este, este, este módulo ha ¿Esto? venido cargadito. Sí, bien este cargadito. Módulo, este módulo ha venido cargadito de, sí. de vocabulario muy, muy técnico. Sí. Si, lo, si lo saben no, aprovechar, sí. si lo saben aprender, les va a servir de mucho. Sí. Así es. I don't know if you have another question related with the topic. An specific topic or, or not? Specific topic? No. In the okay. exam. Ah, oh, right. In, in, in the midterm. <laughs> ¿Sabe lo que pasó con el midterm? Ah, eh, okay. Hace ¿Sí? como dos sesiones y vamos a hacer el review del midterm. Y vamos, uh -huh. a, y vamos a revisar cada uno de los ítems. Pero se dio cuenta que todavía habían como cuatro o cinco personas que no lo habían realizado. No lo habían realizado, no se podía. ¿no? Entonces yo no me podía uh, poner a hacer un review cuando uh -huh. ellos no habían hecho eso, era darle la respuesta. Sí, entonces, cabal. Entonces, no, it's not fair to do that, you know. Mm, no se podía. Así es. O sea que ya, ya casi ya en un, una semana prácticamente, ya la otra semana se termina. Sí, de, después de esta. Lo único que sí. como llevamos... Eh, Llevamos un desfase de un día por el Día de las Madres. Ah, sí, el Día de las Madres. Sí. Bueno, el Día de las Madres y algunos cortitos que han habido. De, de, de así sí. que, que no sí, nos, también, Pero de la energía hubo un día no, sí. que no iba a funcionar. Entonces, varios varios en, se lo perdieron. Sí, entonces más creo que después de la otra semana quizás todavía nos va a tomar como dos días. Dos para, días. Va. Para nivelarnos. No. Así es. Ok, ya. Es que paciencia y hay que respirar, <risa> respirar mucho y tomar mm. aire. Y cuando alguna palabra no la oiga muy bien, tal vez. Uh -huh. Porque a veces uno, eh, depende del de, el, el ordenador que tenga, si es el teléfono o la computadora, puede oír diferente. Y alguien puede decir, no, te lo dijo así de este modo, pero si, si me pide que se lo repita otra vez, a veces no sé si se ha fijado, 
Cuando alguien uh -huh. tiene problemas para pronunciar una palabra, yo le trato de modificar un poco el sonido a fin de que se sí. le haga fácil. Sí. Para que cuando ya llegue al básico sí. y la oye de otro momento, eso le va a hacer un medio cambio y ya. Ya, ya más. Este, Porque de una le cuesta llegar al, al, al sonido que no debería, pero bueno, sí. yo. ¿Verdad? Ok, sí. mío Wendy. Sí, está bien. <risa> thank you okay, very much thank you. and I hope to see you tomorrow you. recuerde que mañana es viernes así you. es que así es que hay que hay que trabajar todavía viernes todavía viernes <risa> <risa> oh, ok bye no, bye good night bye good night ah, tra trabaja Definitely. sábado también Sí, hasta mediodía ah, sí, okay, I'm sorry I'm sorry to hear that <risa> yeah, I, 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 I have to do it too Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Blessings. Y esperemos que se grabe esta cosa porque si no. Oh, sí. Sí. No, ¿Y pero cómo ya sabes? tengo. Ya tengo la. No, es que al uh, al nomás que le doy okay. terminar Ajá. y cerrar la sesión, entonces comienza a a convertir el vídeo. Entonces mm, cuando no lo convierte. cuando no lo convierte, entonces ahí me aflijo porque digo se me perdió. Bye. No, primero que, que no, no que esperemos, esperemos que sí funcione todo bien. Ok, bye bye, bien. good night. Bye, bye. See you tomorrow. See you.